Um, Jade, I thought you were not a thief and not violent. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. I can't believe it. The sun is actually out today. This must be a good sign. Alright, I need to make some more money. But you know, I really need power. Those sky shards have me intrigued. I mean, were they left there for me or for someone else? I need to talk to somebody else who can... I mean, I'm just wandering around here aimlessly. There ought to be somebody who can help me. What about Mercurio? He knows a lot. Good morning. love like a saber cat, or crush your enemies to dust like... If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. Good morning, Dryori. <laughs> All right, my curio. I don't know if I got money. Let me see. I probably do have enough to pay for your services, but listen. I need... What do I need? Let me, let me think about this carefully now. I'm not really sure. Um... I need to know where I can, you know, I'm looking for a tip from you, because I, I know you, you charge a lot, so a tip added to my tab, where can I learn about illusion magic? Because I know you're, you're a destruction mage, so I, I know you've already told me, you know, you can teach me some destruction, but... <laughs> Illusion, I'll have to find a, a trainer, and I, I can't afford to go to the College of Winterhold. So, it's too far, it's too expensive, it's what people don't realize is that actually is a tuition that has to be paid, and I can't afford that. So, I, I want to know if there's somebody outside of the college that can train me in illusion magic. What? It... it it would be dangerous, but you know someone. All right, well, tell me what you know. What? You, you think I need to embrace being a thief? <laughs> what? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, you've heard that I've been arrested a few times for thievery, I see. Okay. I need to become a better thief, huh? So, how how can I do that? I see. All right, well, thank you. Curio is good for tips. So, he says to go to the Temple of Mara, and there might be somebody here who can help me become a better thief. I wonder who that... It better not be Maramal. I don't want to insult him. You think he was a thief in a past life? <laughs> wow, that would be something. I can't imagine that, though. Maramol, how are you today? How may I help you, my son? Um. Well, I'll take a blessing of Mara, please. May the blessing of Mara be with you. Thank you. May you return to her benevolence and safety. How about the white cotton? Perhaps Helga does not like the flowers with colors. Hmm, maybe you're right. I'll take 50. 
Excuse me. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Why won't Helga acknowledge me? Who are you? And what is it you do here? That's an odd and brusque way to address a stranger now, isn't it? Well, I apologize for my rudeness. I, I'm simply curious. Yes, I understand. Curiosity is the driving force in many of our lives, and the failure to sate it can lead to many a frustration. Sometimes I think it's best to just sit down and read about other people's adventures instead. What about you? Do you enjoy the art of reading? Um, well, uh... Uh... Let's see... Well, I, I tend to skip through books, to be honest. I really, in my current situation, don't have time to, to read or have any books to read, except sometimes when I'm exploring, you know, I'll, I'll find books on shelves and I'll read them, but I pretty much just skip through them. I get it. You seek the knowledge, but not the wisdom. You boost your skills while failing to develop your character. Well, I... Uh, that's one way of putting it, I suppose. So, are you a friend of Helga's? I'm not a friend, I'm a suitor. Oh. If only I could convince Excuse her to me. see me as such. Well, let's see. Um, How's that working out for you? Not well. No matter how ferociously I chase the woman, she treats me as if I just contracted swamp fever. Does she think I'm an Argonian? I've never even seen this one. Um, no offense. None taken. Yes, it's not like I don't have friends that are Argonian. Real ones, not the imaginary kind people make up to hide their prejudice. <laughs> I can even tell you their oh, names. Ujita's a kind soul, and a good fisherman, at least when she isn't offering favors for Skuma. Kirava and mm, Talon Jay are the personification of true love, something we all aspire to achieve. All right, so what what ultimately do you want with Helga? Romance? Marriage? Marry Helga? Now there's a frightening thought. Oh no, I assure you my intentions are entirely puerile. I want to bed her. I want to dip my face in her ample, ample bosom and make crude animal noises. I want to taste her apple pie, eat her sweet roll, and now I'm hungry. <laughs> well... I just lost my appetite. Did I mention her bosom was ample? It yes. seems like an important detail. I see. Yes, it is important. All right. Well, what makes you think that betting Helga will be that easy? It's well known that Helga is what ruffians call a very loose woman. Man, myrrh, dwarven centurion, they say she takes all who are willing. Somehow, I managed to be excluded from this special fraternity. Hmm. Have you tried other women? What about the Temple of Debella? Don't remind me of that place. I saved up all my gold, traveled to the opposite end of Skyrim, and what did they tell me? The sisters are communing with Debella and can't be disturbed. I've never heard a worse excuse in all my years. <laughs> oh no, I'm not going through that again. Helga is right here, and by all accounts, not a picky woman. All right, well, um... I suppose that's it. Um, you wouldn't happen to have a few septums that I could have. You know, maybe a, a, a temporary loan or something? Oh, okay, well... It's been great talking to you. Safe travels. Thank you. Okay, I know you're the you're the woman that sells flowers. Hello. Greetings, traveler. My name is Jade. I Jade, offer you Mara's blessing that her light may guide you on the. Ugh. Who am I kidding? You'll end up like all the rest. What? Excuse me? Oh, you must be new to Riften. Well, if you're looking for marital guidance, I suggest you speak to Maramal or Dinya. 
I can't seem to get a single soul into Mara's embrace. I think I'm cursed. <laughs> Wait, whoa. hold on a minute, Jade. First of all, uh, I'm, I'm Zion, and it's, it's a pleasure to meet you. I was sent here. Sent here to find somebody. I wonder. Mercurio is a very strange soul, but deep down he knows his business. But anyhow, what do you mean you're cursed? As acolytes of Mara, we're supposed to put those who've lost their way back on the path toward true love. But I can't seem to keep a single couple together. <laughs> Sir, go bother Helga. Well, the only way to break such a curse is to find love yourself. Ugh, oh, you sound like Maramal. And suddenly He's right I'm beginning you. to feel nauseous. <laughs> okay. Well, you seem less devout than the other priests I've met. Is it that obvious? I suppose the name's a dead giveaway, too. Well, it's not exactly Jade, a secret huh? around here, so I might as well tell you. I used to be a member of the Thieves' Guild. What? No wonder Mercurio sent me here. Um... So, uh, well, where does the name Jade come from? Well, I didn't really have much use for my old name, so when I met Sapphire, I decided to change my name, too. Green Eyes, Jade... It doesn't take a college mage to figure out that gems make pretty names for girls. I see. Yeah, well, Jade is a nice name. So there must be a reason you still use that name. That's how most people in Riften know me. Dinya suggests that I drop the name as a symbolic gesture, but I feel like that would be running away from who I was and what I've done. And why did you join the Thieves Guild? Do you want the short answer or the long one? Um, well, take your time. I've got Plenty of time. I'm not doing anything. I don't have a job. I don't have a place to live. Take your time. It all goes back to my childhood. For most people, it always does. I grew up an only child, and I don't just mean siblings. I didn't have any contact with other children. What? So when I joined the guild, I felt like they were the brothers, sisters, and friends I never had. So, how did you develop your skills as a thief? When I was a child, my parents would lock me in the library and make me study. That was the extent of their parenting. But I'd always find a way out. Sometimes the books even helped. How did the books help? Some taught me how locks were made, and some showed me how locks are broken. Both helped me pick them. And after a while, not only could I exit the library, but enter the armory. And when I was ready, escape the city entirely. Oh, I can hear the confidence in your voice. Huh. So, what happened after you joined the guild? They had me pick locks. I was good at that, but bad at dealing with the consequences. What do you mean by that? Well, I didn't want to steal from people, but I also didn't want to betray my new friends. So at first, I'd do the job and leave the mark a bit of gold. But a lot of these items were sentimental. They meant something. I could tell. Just by looking at their faces the next day. That hurt more than anything. What a... A remorseful thief? That's interesting. So when did you decide to quit the guild? One day, Vex asked me to do a heist job at the Temple of Mara. She didn't tell me what it was I was stealing, just that it was valuable. That night, Dinya and Maramal were at the Bee and Barb, preaching to the patrons. 
Brielle was showing the temple to a young couple. So, no one saw you enter. What happened next? I stole away into the back, where the living quarters are. If you could call them that. These were not people of wealth. The items Vex wanted weren't even in a strong box. They were on a dresser, right next to a bouquet of flowers. They were wedding rings. Oh, no. When I realized that's what Vex wanted, my heart stopped. I couldn't do it. It seemed wrong. So what did you do? I quit. Right then and there. I threw off my hood, cursed Vex, and turned around. That's when I saw Dinya standing in the doorway. And she did what she always does. What I always needed, but never got from my mother. She hugged me. And I knew then I'd found a home. Oh, come on now. You're gonna make me get emotional. All right, well, that is something. Um... So, uh, well... You know, you could do more for Mara by spreading her word. I suppose anything is better than handing out Dinya's letters. All right. If you need me, I'll follow. You will? You don't go anywhere dangerous, do you? Oh, I do. <laughs> um, let's see. Well, I need your help, actually. I mean, you, you were with the Thieves Guild, and I need to embrace becoming a thief. Mercurio, I'm sure you know him. He, he sent me here to meet someone that might be able to guide me on my path. So, you're okay with me stealing stuff, right? I'm not, what? but I know I can't stop you. Just try to remember the consequences of your actions. But, okay. Well then, follow me. I need you to help me become a better thief. All right, let's go. Oh, thank you. All right, let's go. Sometimes I worry about oh, Sodrin. Brielle? That elf fiddles with his dagger more times than a Don't stare at us too much. Or a priestess. Maramal, I'm going to take your assistant. Whatever she is, Acolyte, I'm going to take her with me for a while. We'll be back. And thank you for all the help, everything you've done, and Mara's blessing. Jade, let's go. All right, so... For me to embrace becoming a thief, where do you think we should start? Hmm. Okay. All right, I understand. All right, I think I have enough money for a carriage ride. Let's go. Buy some armor and live to tell about it. So, you really have given up the Thieves' Guild life, the life of a thief. I half expected you to have a suit of armor that you would switch into, but you were still Come on now. looking like a, a humble monk. Um, sir. Carriages to all the cities in Skyrim. Okay. Don't forget us. Where do you want to go? Um... This is probably going to be hard for me. Uh... White Run? Run straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere along the way? 
Oh, it stops in Riverwood. This is where she said we should go. All right, take me to Riverwood. Climbing back. And take off. us to Riverwood. Come on, Jane. You ever met one of them cats? Khajiit, I think they call themselves. I hear there's whole countries full of them down south. I'm in the city. I'm always afraid I'll run into someone I know. At least I know that won't happen here. Yeah, probably not. Okay, so, uh... Where do we need to go? Oh, okay, this way. Alright, let's go. I love these bright nights. Jay didn't even come in. Here she is. Come on. There. Now maybe you'll keep up with me. All right, let's go. Yeah, that's better. I don't know why Mercurio thinks I should embrace becoming a thief. I mean, I, I was trying to pick myself up, get my life back on track, but, you know, sometimes we're spoken to through people. Spoken to by the divine through people. Uh-oh, what's wrong? Something's out there. Okay, let's keep going. So, if Mercurio was saying I should become a thief, how do I know it's really Mercurio that's telling me that? Are we being followed? Look out, there's something there. Oh, it's a rabbit. Well, that can't be what it was. Jade, Jade, be careful. What is it? What? Is this a bandit over here? Oh, Isidore. Spells aren't gonna work on him. Let's go. Come on. Jay, let's leave him alone. Jade. You you two stop staring at each other. Unless it, one of you is gonna get wet. We need to just leave. Oh, no, what? There's no escape. Maybe I can calm you down then, Jade. I can't even see where to aim this. Of course, you're too powerful, too. The whole world is too powerful. Oh, here they come.
Jade, you, you act like you know this man. Is he, is he a, a suitor of yours? Look, if you want to stare him down, that's fine. Just tell me where I need to go. Go on up ahead, thank you. So she said there's some sort of stones up here that can imbue power. That's gonna be interesting. This is really beautiful. Look at this nighttime sky. Wow. You know, it's moments like this that you can just forget all your problems. Well, it's, thank you. Thank you for coming. It's a good thing I'm not paying you. All right, these are the stones. Which one can make me a thief? <laughs> okay, this one. All right. Those under the sign of the thief have more stamina, move faster, and take less damage from falling. This is going to help me. The parents were a bit strict, but I know right. they wanted the best for me, and I know it was childish to run away. Mara, I just hope they forgive me. What? What's going on? Sounded like explosions. All right, I'm a thief now. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. Did you, you killed him? Come on. Where? It's all about search. Search a body. All right, how how'd the body get way up? I'm not. You know what? Look, there's something up here. Let's let's go see what's going on up here. Is it? You seem very calm. <laughs> what? Okay, well. Um, Jade, I thought you were not a thief and not violent. Okay. going inside. Oh, it's well lit in here. Uh-oh. Uh -oh, they look what? dangerous. Who? Are you sure you Who's want to they? Fight? Jade! You, you were with the Thieves Guild, why are you? All right, never mind, come on. I'll try to protect you the best I can. You know, I didn't need to continue gathering ingredients. Are you worried someone will wander in here? The entrance isn't exactly hidden, you know. This again? I told you. Have someone stand guard out. Don't forget the rock trap. So stop your worrying and get some rest. Someone there? Get back, get back. Get a die for that. What are you doing? 
Jade. Oh, she goes from one extreme to the other. And she's scared. She doesn't want to steal anything. And then she's running right on into a fight. Oh, no, she's down. She's up. I'll take care of him. Once were the ones. Um, sir. All Keep right. your hand. Why, why do I even try? Okay, so. Pickaxe. Let me mine some ore. I need to continue to work on my smithing skills and all my skills. Corundum ingot. I mean, if you want some armor, we can, um, you know, steal some from these bandits. What what do you do? What's your specialty? Okay, I guess you're gonna have to surprise me. I mean, all I've seen now is you running around with a little iron dagger. to get the feeling you're enjoying this. Did something just touch me? I think something just touched me. Oh, I really don't like caves. I don't believe you. Wait. You cut this man's head off. Maybe he cut the head off. All right, let's go. Stay behind me. some steel if you want to fight me. Well, I gotta steal another hand. Hey, what? Ah! This will be fun. Oh! oh!
Mm, alteration spells 25% less. Oh, a sky shot splinter. supposed to happen. Jade! That's all the magic I got. Okay. You might think this is weird coming from a former thief, but 
I have no sympathy for bandits. None. There is no excuse for what they do. Okay. Well. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, okay, I can see that. All right. I was not finished over here. So first of all, iron. I could certainly use that. Take this iron ore. Iron ingots. Take the lock pick. So I, I do have a gift for yes. you. Um, let's see. I need to trade some things. Let's trade. Oh, you got a steel dagger. Never mind. Blessing of Mara upon I you. I thought it was iron. Okay. So, let me just be sure now there's no smelter here. split um, this loot with you. then I think we're done I was hoping that this uh mine in this uh whatever I'm doing with this ore would have given me um smithing experience, but it doesn't seem to. Come on, let's go. Alright, that was Embashard Mine. Let's go back to Riverwood and see if there's a smelter there. I, somehow, I don't think so. And I don't think there's one in Riften either. Smelter. 
But you know what? Hello. Ain't every day we get visitors in Riverwood. You looking for a new blade? Do you need any help around the forge? Yes, actually. How about you snip me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Thank you. See? I... You're doing the things that Balaman never, never would show me. Whatever you need. Buy Ismir if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. Here's the iron dagger. Not bad, but it's a little dull. How about you sharpen it up? Just need a bit of metal and the grindstone over there. All right, then. Jade. All You're right. looking for a new blade? I've sharpened the dagger. This looks good. You put time into your blades. They'll serve you well when you need them. You want to keep helping? How about you make some armor? Let's start by tanning some leather on the rack. Okay. Until next time. Iron or steel is what you need. Leave that fancy elven Here, stuff to the Here's elves. the leather that you wanted. Ah, good. A lot of weapons and armor need leather for straps, fittings, that kind of thing. Let's see if you can make a hide helmet. Here's the rest of what you need. All right. Whatever you need. Buy Ismir if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. Here's the hide helmet. Huh. I should hire you to be my assistant at this rate. Hey. Let's improve the fit. Hey. Take this leather to the workbench. You, you, you got a deal. I'm working with somebody in Rifton. Who, I mean, he's very stingy with the information, but I appreciate it, though. Until next time. Looking for a new blade? I've tempered the hard helmet. You have talent. Keep working at your craft, and you'll be a fine smith one day. Why don't you keep that dagger and helmet? Maybe you'll remember me when you're making Skyforge steel, huh? All right, deal. Thank you. I appreciate it. It's good to meet you, Albor. Zion. Hopefully I'll see you again if I come through here. All right, Jade. Um, hmm. well, you think you're ready to go back to Riften? Okay, sounds like a plan to me.